Welcome to SGS Old Testament Bible Reading Training, Day 5. Good morning, friends. We have run through 11 lessons, 9 of which are revisions from New Testament training. If you missed them, kindly go over them. Today, we will discuss the modalities. The modalities of Old Testament are slightly different from New Testament. Please read carefully. Old Testament modalities. We believe you all pass through New Testament reading or you cannot be here. So, we believe that you know the drill. You read up, you stay. If you fall below the cutoff, you get removed. Quite simple. But our leaders will not sin against God by not praying for you or encouraging you all the way. An intercessory unit has been set up among leaders for daily prayers for every one of you. We believe that there will be numerous testimonies in Jesus' name. Amen. Each team has a team leader. We want to know how many chapters you have read per day because we will be taking statistics daily. We will release cut off and then eviction will be done at the end of each phase. If a participant is behind the cut off mark at the end of each phase, such participant has chosen not to continue with us and we hence be relieved. It is our duty to help everyone get to the finish line. I pray that God will help us all. Nobody said anything about it being easy, but we said that grace will be available to make it easy. If you believe, say this like you mean it. I will make it to the finish line. If you can skip through the first five books, then believe me that you will make it to the finish line. As long as you remain determined, trusting in the Holy Spirit. 2 Timothy 2 and verse 3 Thou, therefore, endure hardness as a good soldier of Jesus Christ. You also have in Deuteronomy chapter 31 Verse 8, in the New Living Translation says, Do not be afraid or discouraged, for the Lord will personally go ahead of you. He will be with you. He will neither fail nor abandon you. Don't forget to care for your group members. Carry them along. We must win together. Don't leave the work to your team leader alone. Check on your group members. Choose a partner if you have to. Or ask to be a group leader. There is no competition, but we must challenge one another and finish together. The daily report is as simple as saying this on your sub-WhatsApp groups daily. Day 1 done. Day 2 done. Or Day 1 Genesis 1 to 8 done. Or you could also highlight the task and tag task complete. It depends on how you choose, but pass the information across. Please, I beg you all, by the mercies of God, to reduce the stress of your team leaders by providing your reports daily. It's very important. If you don't report, they will be forced to check up on you, chat you up, or call you. That will take their time. Help them by reporting without being asked. It's really a long journey, and we must endeavor to help one another. And for the purpose of emphasis, please, no competition. Do well to celebrate those who have the free time and grace to read ahead 
rather than being bitter or feeling intimidated, at the end of the Old Testament reading, you will be required to share your testimony and experience on our Facebook platform to encourage others in the future. I pray that we will all reach the finish line and testify in Jesus' name. Amen. Detailed breakdown of the reading exercise. The Old Testament has 929 chapters. The readings will be divided into 12 phases, which consist of 10 days each. At the end of each phase, 10 days, we will observe a one-day break for discussions and prayer. We also use the break to get refreshed and give opportunities to participants that might be lagging behind to meet up. We'll be reading eight chapters per day except Psalm 99 to Psalm 118 which will be divided into seven chapters per day. Psalm 119 will be assigned a whole day due to how long it is. None of us will fall by the wayside. God will see us through. He that started this good work in us will bring it to perfection in Jesus' name. Amen. I pray that God Almighty will strengthen everyone and grant us grace to make the journey swift and smooth for us and none that begin will drop away in Jesus' name. Amen. Team WhatsApp groups and team leaders. Our team leaders have started reaching out already. If you have not been reached, Check your WhatsApp or SMS for messages. If you can't find any message, please exercise patience. If by Friday evening you still have not heard from your leader, then you can signify by reaching your platoon leader so that you will be attended to. Their duty is to add you to a sub-WhatsApp group of about 26 to 31 participants to closely monitor your progress and ensure that you reach the finish line. Disclaimer, if anyone asks you for money or assistance, they are not from us. Our team leaders, we never ask you for anything apart from matters that concern your finishing strength. Secondly, always confirm if the person reaching out to you is an admin on our platforms before accepting their invite link. And if not an admin, kindly report to any of the admins on our platforms. We have come to the end of the training. Note. You will be required to drop participation reports on your subgroup. Thank you. Shall we pray? Heavenly Father, Lord, we thank you for your love, mercy, grace, and kindness towards every one of us since the beginning of this Trinity now. Father, Accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Lord, we pray that as we have prepared our body, soul, and spirit to read your word, so as to draw closer to you and know you better than ever before, please, Lord, give us grace and strength in Jesus' name. Father, please. It is our desire that no one will fall away on the journey. Thanks so much for all you have done. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen.
man. This training was prepared by the convener Oluwa Tomisin at Jileye, edited by the editorial team and voiced by Pastor Oluwa Timlehi Adeluba. God bless you.